is up guys it is smashcraft9 here and today i'm bringing you guys a tutorial on how to make a quicksand trap and i have disguised it in this house and i'm just gonna show you how to work how it works if i'm just gonna hop into survival you just walk in and it just the sand slowly starts to disappear we can just throw this stuff because we won't need it and as you go down you start to burn and it's really slow because the sand kind of stops you and then it starts going faster and then you die and the way I built it is let's just let's let me get into the back yeah that's a weird thing with the new update it like shows the two knobs there but not the other one and it's just basically this but I will show the redstone right here and the first thing you have to do step one you have to dig a four by four hole so it should be going four down four to the right and to the left and four up and down so it should look like this one two three four one two three and four and that's how it should look like just a four by four by four hole step two you have to add the lava only on the bottom so then there should be only now three instead of four like that one just add some lava Step three, you're gonna add some cobwebs just on top of the lava. Now you should have two. And step four is where it starts to, it's not really confusing, just the redstone comes in. In step four, you're just gonna add some redstone. You first have to add your pe pressure plates. You're gonna add your redstone, connecting both of them because you don't only want it to be on one. Then you just have it line across until there's a block. You're gonna place a block down and put redstone on the other side like this then you're gonna continuously uh, add on some redstone get having four redstone repeaters facing up with uh, sticky pistons make sure they're sticky pistons shooting out and connect redstone so it should more or less look like this and put a block in front of it and then after it's pushed out you have to see that it's pushed out and it's well aligned with the bottom you are ready to move on to step five. And as you can see, look, I'll just show you. It pulls that back. And step five, all you have to do is add signs. It's really simple making this. You just add signs. You have to make sure that it starts off like, say, I don't wanna break it or else it's all gonna fall apart. If you have this, if that's the wall, you have to place this and you have to place it off of it. Cause look, when you break this, they all are gonna fall. And that's what's gonna help us into step six. So after you have added the signs, starting here on to step seven, you're just gonna cover it up with sand. It's really simple, you, it, everything's the same. You just cover it up with sand. So that, or gravel, either one, so it can fall and you're finished this is basically the finished product i'm just gonna show you how it works this is it with this the uh, a good way to add on to it is if you get carpeting and like a house it won't look like it and then when you fall in you guys get my point just try to disguise it with carpet or something like that and i just made this little entrance and then you just fall and it slowly starts to kill you until you die and let's just wait for this to kill me and see you can't really like get out too fast it's gonna kill you so and by the way when once you get under the sand it starts to suffocate you and burn you that's why it goes faster and a good thing about it the one that i was just on i'll show you it it can it takes away the sand after it touches the lava which is pretty good see the lava, the sand just, uh, more or less, how do I say this? It just, like, a block. If you place a block into, not, not a block, if you drop an item into lava, it breaks, and falling sand will do the same. Not if it's falling, like, how, like, falling, falling, but if it's slowly going with cobwebs, it will. And in the end right here, I have... Please subscribe, like, rate, and most importantly, tell your friends, uh, and 
that's basically it. I hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.